Hello all, welcome to Selenium Python training series. In this session, as part of Introduction to Selenium, I am going to explain whether Selenium is an open source tool or not. Yes, the answer is simply yes. Selenium is a open source test automation tool. What does this term open source means? Open source means the code which is written by the developers of Selenium to develop that Selenium test automation tool is open to everyone. Anyone can access the code written by the developers of Selenium for developing that Selenium tool. Okay. Let me practically prove you that Selenium is an open source tool where the code written by the developers for developing Selenium tool is open. Okay. So let me open the browser and here I will search like this Selenium space GitHub. Yes. Search like this. You see GitHub page for Selenium. Click on this. You'll be taken to a page where you will see who is working on this uh, Selenium tool. Here you see at this moment some person is working and uh, there are like contributors. This many people are working guys. Okay. 677 for now as on today's date and all. Okay. So these people are keeping this code open guys. Okay. Whatever the code they are writing here to develop selenium or improvising selenium right that particular code is open anyone can download and copy the code you see here is a button code button and you can download zip the moment you say download zip the entire code that is written for developing selenium is getting downloaded in the zip file you can extract that and see the code whatever the code or you can even see from here guys click on this and you know all the code will be visible guys you see src uh Selenium, let's keep on clicking, okay? So Chrome, let's keep on clicking and see, you see Java files are coming. Whatever the code that is written by the developers of Selenium is open, you see that particular file, the code is open guys, how they have written the code, everything is open to the public. But are all the tools available in the market are open source? No, okay, they're not. For example, the operating system I'm using in my laptop is Windows 11 operating system at this moment. This operating system code, do I have anywhere? Can I get the copy uh, of the code written by the Microsoft uh, guys for uh, that they have written for developing this Windows 11 operating system or any MS Word files or uh, MS Word software or anything? Those code is not open to everyone. That is private code, okay? So the Microsoft team or the developers of Microsoft uh, who are working for the Microsoft company are not sharing those code outside the company. Rather, Microsoft is keeping the code at themselves in a mode of private, okay? The privately they are, and they are selling the software, okay? Without sharing the code, they are selling the software for some amount. Here, but coming to Selenium kind of tool, okay? Not only it is free, guys, but also it is open source. The code that is written for developing Selenium test automation tool is available online. You can download it. You can modify it. You can create one more tool out of it if you are very sure about Okay, everything is open, guys. That's why we have to say that Selenium is an open source tool. Okay, Selenium is an open source tool where the code written by the developers who are developing the Selenium tool is open to everyone or public. So that's all for this session. In the next session, I'm going to cover another topic from this introduction to Selenium category of Selenium Python training series. Till then, see you. Bye-bye.